What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Ryan here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Modern Warfare Remastered Torrent File H1, H1 Client. Um, now, this works if you already have Modern Warfare Remastered on Steam. The only thing you're going to need to do is download this, and then, you know, you just hit download. Go over there. Um... Always make sure you, if you go to your files, make sure you have a, um, you know, a, a, a file path for your one for H1. Uh, you also need the qubit torrent, as you can see right here. Um, this is pretty much, this is Black Ops 1. I'll make another video on that as well. But you're going to need this, which I will link this in the description. And so what you're going to do is basically you're going to take the H1 full files that you get. This will be a torrent file, obviously. So with the DLCs, you'll put those in the torrent. Now, it is 80, what does it say, 82 gigabytes. So it is going to take a while, but it is worth it. Um... So you, what you'll do is you'll download this. So pretty much what you're going to do is you're going to download it right right here. You take that file and then you're pretty much just going to do this. So I will link, like I said, I'll link everything in the description. Oh, that's not what I want. Um, copy. Paste. Pretty much what you're going to do. Oh, that is not what I wanted. Pretty much what you're going to do is you're going to take this, don't uncheck anything, just make sure you set a file path. Like I said, I did H1, make a folder, put it in there with all the DLCs, and you're just going to hit OK. Now, like I said, it's going to take forever, so I'm not going to reinstall it because I already did. Um, So you already have to put that in there in the to Qubit Torrent. I'll link the Qubit Torrent link to download. Everything's all free. Um, that's pretty much what you're going to do. And then, when you do that, you're going to go to this website. And you're going to go to this website. Oh, is it? Why is it not working? Anyway. Uh, H1 GitHub. Let's see. Uh, let me get the uh, actual link, and I'll be right back. All right, sorry guys, I have to go get the link. Um, pretty much what you're gonna do is gonna go to this website, GitHub H1 mod, and you're just gonna pretty much just download this right here, the H1-mod.exe. You're gonna download that, and when that's done downloading, uh, you just got to wait for your uh h1 to download and then once you do that you're pretty much set uh h1 like you said make sure you put your h1 client like the exe inside of your um you know your modern warfare uh h1 mod make sure you put that because that's the only way you're going to do it and then what you're going to do is you're going to click this go to multiplayer and it should show you this Oh no. Um if you want I will leave their Discord in the description as well. You join there if you have any questions, camos that you want to get added to the game or put in your own camos. And it's gonna ask you to do an update, you do that, and then and then yeah, that's that's how you get Modern Warfare remastered, you know. It's it's pretty simple, um, so that's pretty much what you're gonna do. Like, it it, it took me a minute to uh, figure out how to do it, but once I learned how to do it, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna teach everyone else how they do how how everyone else does it. Um, you can also, if you go into your stats, you can unlock everything. As you can see here, I have everything. Um, M16, obviously, you know, you had to get the exclusion zone. But, yeah. That's 
that's pretty much it. I mean, you get all the weapons. Like, see, you get, you get all the weapons. Everything. All the snipers, shotguns, LMGs. Uh, all the... Everything here, including the DLC weapons that came out. That was a pain in the ass to get for everyone. Um, all the melees, everything. Um, if you guys haven't played Modern Warfare Remastered, you guys will already know the M16 is still fucking broken. Um, it has not changed. There's really no change in anything. Uh, you can use controller. That's what I'm using. Let me see. And then this is, you know, it's still the same. Like I said, it's still, it's, yeah, see, you get the Karambit. I used to have this one. I actually played legit, but I actually had it on PlayStation. So, yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty self simple. So. If you guys like this uh, and want me to show you guys how to install the Black Ops 1 on Plutonium, make sure you hit that like button, uh, subscribe, make sure you follow me on Twitch at Ryanator1. I will be streaming this. And yeah, it's been your boy Ryan, and I'm out. Peace out.